Hey church, good morning. Hope you really enjoyed our Easter at home services and pray that you were blessed by that. Welcome to day 13 of our prayer challenge. Uh, we're coming out of 2 Chronicles 7.14 this morning that says, If my people who are called by my name humble themselves, pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways, I will hear from heaven and forgive their sins and heal their land. You know, I think a lot of times about the way that we pray in our heart when we pray, and this morning we're going to be praying, or all day rather, we're going to be praying for a sincere heart. Um, and, and, you know, I've got small kids, and a lot of times when they get in trouble, they uh, they just tell, us, tell their sorry so they don't get in any more trouble. You know, there's no real feeling, there's no real actual repentance or apology there. And, and sometimes I think that's how we pray. We just do it because we're told to or because... It's the checklist thing, and, and so our prayer life is fairly empty. Um, but I can be sure last night, many of you, as the storms rolled through our area, were praying very sincerely for protection over your homes and for protection over your family. And so it's with that type of heart that we should approach God, one that is engaged, one that is urgent, and one that sincerely is looking for His blessing and for His forgiveness. Um, and so I want to encourage you that you know, especially on the heels of our great Easter service, that you're praying with a grateful heart because of all of the things that God has done, that you are praying because you want to talk to God just like He wants to talk to you. I guess basically the question that I want to put before you this morning, the day after Easter, is are you praying simply because you have to, because you're supposed to, or are you praying because you want to? As the guide tells us, Psalm 139.23 says, Search me, O God, and know my heart. Try me and know my thoughts. It's my hope and prayer this morning that you would be that audacious and that bold and you would pray that God would search your heart and whatever he finds, if it's not true, that we would begin to make steps to change that and to pray with a sincere heart. Love you guys. Miss you. See you soon.